All right, folks, try a dirt works back at you with another video today. Another equipment loading demonstration. You saw the ditch witch. You saw how we get it loaded. But we're going to raise the stakes a little bit and show you how we load an excavator. Now, an excavator is a lot more difficult to load than the ditch witch. It's got a lot higher center of gravity. That means it'll slip and turn and, and fall off a lot easier. And you can see why it's getting these ramps ready. Put them in the slot. We'll go to the next one. Now these ramps, these are not light ramps. They're probably 150 pounds a piece. So steel ramps. We want to get the aluminum ramps, but we work with what we got here. So he's going to get those and then we're going to put jacks up under the trailer so we don't jar the trailer because whenever you run a piece of equipment up the end it pushes down on the end of the trailer and the only thing holding it down is the lift cylinder we break a seal on that that's a bad day so he's going to put this other one over there so that trailer can't travel as much now in this demonstration we'll show you how to safely load an excavator at least in our experience, safely load. We're actually gonna raise the pitch of the trailer using the dump cylinder to aid in that teeter-totter. We're not gonna have as much teeter-totter on the top end, so it'll just make it a little more safe to, safe to load. So he's gonna hook up the trailer and raise it just a little bit. So just bear with us while he does that. Let's see if we can get a shot of it raising. You can accomplish the same thing if you don't have a dump trailer by just using your terrain to your advantage. Like here, we're kind of on a downhill slope here, so it, it kind of does it naturally. So he's going to raise that trailer up just a little bit, all right? And it makes this approach angle a lot less steep. So you just kind of use everything to your advantage to, uh, to help you out and make it make the job safer so we'll check back in with you whenever we're ready to load all right here comes dad on the approach he's going to line up with this with these ramps here but one other thing I, I didn't mention in the intro whenever it's raining and this gets slick like we talked about in the other video you're going to want to just be very careful with how you approach it and sometimes we'll put a chain to the front of here hook it onto the bucket so we can pull ourselves on because you these tracks will slip on this metal when it's wet so you'll pull yourself up onto it see he's got a little bit of a teeter-totter uses that boom to level it out and jump up onto the trailer but you'll he'll grab onto a chain in the rain that's hooked up up here to there and there and use it as a as a guide to pull himself on so it's just little tricks like that to keep you safe and keep you just keep you working but if you get caught in a rainstorm and can't get yourself loaded on a trailer that's not a good time you gotta leave your machine or just wait out the rain so just stay tuned for more tips and tricks from dirt gobbler And we'll catch you on the next one. Another safe way of unloading without tilting up is keeping your bucket down and kind of let it ride on the ground like he's doing and then lower yourself down, kind of get you more on that plane and it prevents the teeter totter. Hey folks, appreciate you watching. We'll catch you on the next one.